Hey everyone, it's Vanessa here with Lighthouse Kids Company and today we're gonna talk about a super important cloth diapering issue, ammonia and cloth diapers. So if you have issues with ammonia, washing cloth diapers, this video is for you. So number one thing we wanna talk about when it comes to ammonia and cloth diapers is that it's not always the cloth diaper. What you really have to see is, are you smelling the baby's pee? or are you smelling dirt trapped in the cloth diaper? So it's very common to smell ammonia in cloth diapers. For example, the first diaper of the morning, or if maybe your baby had something that's uh, really stinky, like asparagus, you are gonna have that smell. If your baby's not drinking enough water or liquids, their urine might be more concentrated just like an adult. And if that's the case, you're gonna smell the ammonia or urea smell a little bit harder because just like adults, the urine is not diluted. So when the baby goes in the diaper and you can actually smell that smell, take a look and see if it's because the baby is dehydrated or it's because your diapers have an issue. If you smell it right away, but not when the cloth diapers are out of the wash, that means there's nothing wrong with your diaper. Usually you're just smelling the ammonia on the baby's urine. Now when it's not okay is when you get the diaper out of the wash and they smell like ammonia or as you're drying them in the dryer, you have the barnyard or ammonia smell. Barnyard is a separate issue. We'll talk about that in a different video, but if it smells right out of the dryer, that's a problem. One thing you can do too is make sure your baby is always hydrated. What do you do with a really stinky diaper then? So let's say your baby does have a weird stinky pee, especially toddlers, that's really common. One thing you can do to avoid that ammonia buildup smell is to use a cloth diaper sprayer, spray your diapers before putting them in the diaper liner. And what this is gonna do is rinse out that pee smell until your wash day. So that's a tip that's really, really helpful if you have that stinky ammonia smell in your diapers. And it also prevents the diaper from building up that ammonia smell. Tip number two is make sure that you have a proper wash routine. A proper wash routine depends on where you live, depends on what water type you have, depends on how much detergent to use. But if you have poor wash routine, if you're not washing your diapers correctly and they're coming out of the wash smelling like ammonia, you know you have a problem. I have a video that I'm gonna link on the comments below about a super simple wash routine that works for 90% of people. And if it doesn't work for you, you can tweak it to make it work for you. Let's say that you're washing your diapers and you put them in the dryer or you dry them outside and they still have that disgusting ammonia smell. Now you have a problem. And what you wanna do at this point, drip the diapers and get them super clean. One thing that's never failed me that I love to use is a product called Funk Rock from Rock and Green. And this product's really good. What I do is I do a soak and basically for about two to three hours or overnight with pretty hot water, not super hot that it's gonna damage the diapers, but hot enough to kind of get the grit out of it and really soak it in. You're actually gonna see dirt uh, coming out of that wash. Once you do that strip, then you just wash as normal and your diapers should be reset. If your diapers continue to smell, again, that's a wash routine issue and you really wanna fix your wash routine to make sure that your diapers are coming out clean. Another thing that you wanna watch for with ammonia is whether you're using microfiber inserts. Microfiber inserts are notorious for holding on to stink. Inside of the fabric is almost like curls. And what happens is, is once you get smells or poop or anything like that stuck in that fabric, it's really hard to get out. So I highly, highly recommend bamboo inserts. Bamboo is super easy to wash and they hold up a lot better. You're gonna have less issues in the long run because it's much easier to keep clean. You're not gonna have that curl pattern inside the fabric that holds on to stink. If you're on a really tight budget, you can try to funk rock your old microfiber inserts, but again, eventually you're gonna keep having that recurring problem. If you guys are having consistent problems with ammonia, it can lead to ammonia burns, which is something I don't like to talk about because it actually can discourage people from cloth diapering. And it's something that rarely happens, but it can happen if you don't take care of your diapers. So you want to make sure, again, I'll come back to this, that your cloth diaper routine is really on point because that's gonna be the crux of it all. If you do have diapers that for some reason you cannot get the ammonia smell, please change to maybe a plastic free disposable or to something that you can use until you get the cloth diaper situation figured out. The last thing you want to do is expose that very sensitive diapering area for your baby 
to to ammonia burn so you don't want to do that i hope you guys found this video helpful give it a thumbs up if you did and subscribe for more cloth diaper tips and tricks and everything else in between